If you visit a local shelter or large rescue organization to check out the dogs available for adoption, you probably wondered, why do I keep seeing that breed? It's in all of the shelters. The assumption may be that dogs of that particular breed may not make a good pet, or maybe it reinforces stereotypes in the media. In this video, we have listed 10 dog breeds that are most often found in shelters. Number 10, American Pit Bull Terrier. American Pit Bull Terriers are lumped into the Pit Bull or Bully breed family. This may be part of the reason it is seen in shelters in such high numbers. This dog is extremely popular and also has the misfortune of being abused and misused. Some municipalities have even enlisted discriminatory breed bans on pit bulls, which causes them to be relinquished. Pit bulls are generally a very athletic, loyal, and loving dog that can be protective of its humans. Number nine, German Shepherd. Once used by people with less than good intentions, much like the Pitbull is today, the German Shepherd remains a very popular dog for its guarding abilities. This is one of the most commonly misidentified dogs in the shelter. People see black and tan and assume it's a German Shepherd. This breed is very active and can be very loyal and protective of its humans and home. Number eight, Labrador Retriever. Labs often suffer from big black dog syndrome in shelters a theory which argues that big black dogs are adopted less often than other types of dogs. Others say fewer are adopted just because there are so many in shelter and rescue. Whatever the reason, the Labrador is a hugely popular dog, subject to overbreeding by irresponsible breeders. Labs are highly energetic, loyal, and loving dogs that make great family companions. Number seven, Jack Russell Terrier. The Jack Russell Terrier is an extremely popular breed that grew in popularity after the television series Frasier spotlighted a Jack Russell named Eddie. People saw Eddie and it might not meet that expectation. These dogs are usually very active and need to be in a household that can provide a lot of stimulation. They also typically like to bark and play, as well as sometimes chase cats and squirrels. Number six, Dachshund. Wiener dogs, or hot dogs as they're sometimes called, come in all colors, can be smooth coated or long hair, and be standard or a mini. What people don't realize is that these dogs were initially bred in Germany to hunt badgers, so they possess a strong prey drive towards smaller animals in the home, such as cats. Dachshunds are very smart and lovable towards their people, but can sometimes be considered a one-person dog. They're also insufferable snugglers and like to burrow under covers. Number five, Boxer. The Boxer is a large, muscular dog with a square, blocky head, and it is sometimes mistaken for a pit bull. This dog became hugely popular in the late 1990s, and its popularity has yet to subside, which makes it a prime candidate for overbreeding. The Boxer is a very active breed and needs a home that can handle his activity level. The dog makes a great family dog and generally gets along well with children. Number four, Chihuahua. These dogs are extremely popular, especially in urban areas because of their small size. Although they can be found in shelters and rescues across the country, they are more likely to be found in high numbers on the West Coast and Arizona. Some theorize it is because access to spay and neuter services is different in that part of the country. Certain celebrities using chihuahuas as purse accessories have also made the tiny dogs hugely popular. Number three, American Bulldog. Known as one of the dogs in the family of bull breeds, the American Bulldog is the tallest and among the heaviest in the Bulldog family. American Bulldogs weigh between 75 and 125 pounds. They are more athletic than most dogs and therefore make good guardians and protectors. Once again, these dogs can be very loyal and loving, but people need to check to make sure they are not banned as part of the overall lumping of bull breeds by their jurisdiction or their insurance company. Number two, Beagle. Since the arrival of America's most famous Beagle, Snoopy, the popularity of this breed has not waned. Beagles are loving, docile, and very tolerant of people, and unfortunately, this is why they're targeted by the scientific community as research animals. As a family pet, 
They are a hunting breed, so they require a lot of exercise. They are also known for their mournful baying, which might not bode well if you have close by neighbors. Number one, American Staffordshire Terrier. Another of the dogs in the bull breed category, these dogs are sometimes lumped into breed discriminatory bands. The American Staffordshire Terrier has a large muscular build with a large head and pronounced jaws. Originally bred to be a farm dog, it has massive strength and is known for its courage. When in the proper home, these dogs are very loyal and can be very playful and good with children. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. Which is your favorite dog breed? Let us know in the comments. Here are some other cool videos I know you'll enjoy. See you guys later.